So I really wasn't thinking about talking about this channel, uh, tomorrow's teachings, because back in my Master Uguay video, link in the top right corner, go ahead and cue that up for after this video, I know you boys are gonna love that. I really wasn't uh, actually gonna make a video on these guys. <laughs> I said I was in the video, I was like, mm, maybe, and then I basically forgot about it until I was assaulted, visually, with this thumbnail. And then I remembered, oh yeah, that's right. I also have a job as a commentary YouTuber. We have to talk about tomorrow's teachings and why YouTube should probably, uh... <laughs> you know what? I hope YouTube doesn't put a stop to them because I'm gonna be honest here. These are some pretty wild videos that they're just uploading and they're allowed to, right? I like how if you upload like a gun onto YouTube, if it's not in like a video game, you're instantly demonetized. Nothing you can do about it. They just instantly take action against you. But somehow Tomorrow's Teachings is allowed to just upload this. Coming up on Tomorrow's Teachings. I said he's not feeling well. You're a sinner. Shut up and kiss me already. Excuse me? LGBT fatty, wannabe man queer. Man, <laughs> I'm just saying it gets worse than that, boys. The intro was the tame part. If anything, you're supposed to like want to get people hooked into the video with like the best part, but they tend to save the best part for the actual video. And these little, what is the super cut of the video? That's nothing, all right? That is how they get past the uh, YouTube guidelines, if anything. Because if any human reviews this, they're gonna see the little super cut, they're gonna be like, eh? not bad i guess I, I guess we can keep it up because there's no way you see this super cut and then the rest of the video and you're like yep that's 100 fine keep up the video but it gets like darn man i guess somehow tomorrow's teachings found a nice little loophole so they can continue making a uh, this amazing content all right great content hold on hold on hold on hold on who is that uh, she she's the prettiest girl i've ever seen She's bad, man. Go talk to her. I, I can't. What, what do you mean you can't? What if she laughs at me? Ryan, you miss 100% of the shots you don't tank. You better go shoot your shot or I will. Damn, my boy is out here spitting them facts. He said, boy, if you don't go get it, I'ma go get it. <laughs> my boy's already like, you know I don't miss. He said, Ryan, you have been missing too many shots and you have been seeing me play the game for too long. It's time for you to get a W. But I mean, like, you know what? Tomorrow's teaching so far, you know what? I would say that they're teaching a valuable lesson. You do miss 100% of the shots you don't take, but also sometimes you don't know if you want to make the shot. I'm just saying here. <laughs> sometimes it's good to not take the shot because if you don't make it, guess what? You can't be embarrassed for not making the shot if you don't take it. And a uh, little bit of foreshadowing, you know, in the thumbnail right here. Somebody tells me that Ryan's going to be uh, very much wishing he didn't take this shot. You wish he would have just walked off the court. He would have been fine just walking away from the situation and allowing his boy to just drain that three. All right, I'll talk to her. <sighs> hey, I I saw you from over there. Are, are you new here? Yeah, I am. I'm Jackie. What's uh, your name? I I'm Ryan. Thanks for saying hi to me, Ryan. It's hard making friends at a new school. I, I could be your friend. What kind of friend are you talking about here, Ryan? Something tells me you a little bit nefarious with the way you said I could be your friend. I don't know about you, I don't just hop into friendships that fast. Seems like Ryan himself is new to this school. He really needs himself a friend too. <laughs> so far, I'm also loving the uh, dry acting here in tomorrow's teachings video. I get it. They're young, all right. You, you build up your acting as you, you know, you progress throughout your career. I don't know how much of a career you would have after being in one of these videos. I would assume this is the peak. Your career has peaked at this point after being in a Tomorrow's Teaching video or a Darman video because uh, I don't know if you want to put any of this on your resume. Let's continue because it gets, it, trust me, we're about to get to the good part here, boys. Yeah? Yeah. Cool. What are you doing right now? Oh, nothing. Just walking home. Cool. Can I come? Uh, of course. Sweet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he was not expecting Ryan to actually get it. He was like, I just wanted to make my friend feel better before I bag this baddie. <laughs> 
He's actually kind of jealous. He's like, damn. Really? It, it was that easy, Ryan. You just got that aura. Ryan's been hiding this superpower his whole life. This is my room. Wow, I love it. Thanks. Your bed is so comfortable. Thanks. So? What? You gonna do anything? Why, what do you mean? I'm in your room. I came over. Came over for a reason. Oh, uh, do you want to do things? Shut up and kiss me already. Yo, my man Ryan already knew what was up. This man ain't even kissing her. This man is literally making out with his fucking thumb. My boy already knew what was going on. Why is your thumb there, Ryan? You had all that ore before. What, what you doing? Yo, we need full-on lip contact, Ryan. Come on. How the hell are you going to make it this far and then you pussy out here? <laughs> My boy gripped it. <laughs> Jeez, right? Hey, man, I'm just saying, I can tell whenever something's a dick or not, you know, I got one myself. I don't think I need to uh <laughs> get a get a full nice grip just just to make sure. <laughs> just, just a swipe. I would have been like, hmm, that's not what I was expecting. This man said, hold up. This vagina's sticking out a little weird. Hmm. This man said, let me investigate this right quick. What was that? What is what? In your pants. I felt something. What was that? I thought you knew. Knew what? I'm transgender. That was my penis you felt. Why didn't you tell me? I thought you can tell. I'm sorry. Bruh, I'm just saying, you know, if you want to be trans, that's cool and all. But I mean, like, if you're going to go out of your way to look as feminine as possible, why why, why would you think <laughs> some random guy would be like, oh, my God, yep, that, that right there, that baddie, she has to be trans. Yep, I, that's my first thought. Yep, she has to be trans, and I want that. Why would that be anyone's first thought is that, nope, the person that looks like a female is actually... <laughs> And she has a dick. Why would he think that? Please. I I have to know. What is this writing? Why, why would anyone think that? Yes, she went out of her way to look as feminine as possible, but as she has a dick. Because that's every person's first thought whenever they're trying to first get to know someone. Do you have a penis or a vagina? I gotta know. I know I cannot tell because you did a great job at looking the way you want to look. I'm sorry. I, I, typically, if I see a female... <laughs> I'm assuming it is a female. I, I, you know, call me a transphobe or whatever. I'm just saying here, a lot of females out there tend to love looking like females. They don't really need to be hiding their dicks from people, all right? Because they typically don't have them. There's only a uh, very special situation whenever you should be telling people, hey, just let you know. I have a dick. Usually you don't have to tell people that, but, uh, you know, Whenever you're in a certain situation, you should probably be telling people Before anything happens, I have a penis. Just letting you know, you should really know before anything happens, this is a fair warning, I have a penis. And I'm not saying if you look like a guy you should tell people, but if you're trying your best to look feminine, and you're trying to get with someone, I think that should be like your first line of uh, questioning. I think that should be your first truth. I have a penis. That, that, that right there should set you up for a good relationship if the person continues to talk to you because no one's out here trying to be playing guessing games if you have a specific way you would like to be you know looked at in the world you should probably tell people if it's not the you know normal way people look at each other but boys that's our lesson for today because uh <laughs> the video doesn't get any better than that it, it kind of just goes downhill becomes more and more boring as the video goes on that was the height of it <laughs> <laughs> the first two minutes, but I hope you all enjoyed this video and don't forget to like and subscribe and tell me in the comments down below What what is another tomorrow's teaching video that I should take a look at boys because these videos are uh, <laughs> Or this channel is uh, is, is pretty wild, but hope you all enjoyed and I'll see you all tomorrow for another video